Okay, this is going to be a quick uh, demonstration of typecasting. Typecasting is when you take a variable of one type and make it appear as a different type. Uh, this works as long as the variable's internal structure is such that the two uh, representations of that internal data can both be successful. Uh, so for example, we might have a variable of type character and I'll call it C and I'll give it, a give it a value of A, for example. So internally, this A is not being stored as a, as a symbol A. It's being stored as an ASCII value in the character C. The reason we, so numerically, C is, uh, or the variable C is actually storing a numeric value for that letter A. Uh, the reason we call it a character C is so that when we do something like a console.write line, uh, C, it will actually print out for us the letter A. So if I did that real quick, I do that, I get a capital A on the screen here, as you see. Um, that in other words, the, the software knows that a character should be represented as the symbol that it's representing as opposed to the internal storage value of this number. Uh, so can we, can we make it show us that internal number? Well, sure we can. Uh, we can tell it to interpret that storage location as something other than a character. So we could start, for example, with a character with a byte, b, and we can tell it that we want to take on the value of c. So we want the byte b to equal val the, the, the character c. But you'll notice there's this little red under, under squiggle thing, and it says it cannot implicitly convert from type character to byte. The key here is implicitly, meaning that it's not going to guess what I intended to do. I have to very clearly tell it what I intended to do. So I'm telling it, please give me the byte version of the character C. Since C is stored behind the scenes as a, as a numeric value, an ASCII value, uh, I can turn it into an equivalent numeric uh, type. So byte can store 0 to 255. And the ASCII table codes for letters are 0 to 255. So this conversion can work very easily or, or complete or successfully. So now I should be able to write this out. And I'll write out B, the value in byte format. And if I run that, you'll notice that I get the character A from being written out when the character was a, uh, the character C was a character variable. And then the number 65, which is the ASCII value of A, when the uh, when it's being written out in its byte format. So this preceding a variable by a type in parentheses is called a typecast. And I can typecast the other direction as well. If I said B was actual equal to 122, for example, I can do a I can say that C is now equal to the character interpretation of B. So let's do it the other way around. So now if I do console.write line uh, C, I should see the character version of 122, which I do, it's lowercase z. So there's an example of how I can move back and forth between the ASCII value of a character and the byte value of a character using this thing called typecast. Typecasting is useful for a lot of other types of variables as well. This is just a simple example.